Hey guys, Michael here. I'm out here at the hangar and uh, I thought I'd get a quick documentation of what I'm doing here. I've always not, I've always hated my brakes. Um, they're the worst brakes I've ever had in any airplane I've ever flown. And uh, I wanted to do something about it. I did lots and lots of research. Some people are saying the geometry of how the pedals are in the uh, Zenith 750 line is is not that great. And then I got the bigger tires. Some people say do go double pucks on the on the on the brake system. Um, but anyway, a lot of things on the internet what to do. But I'm just going to show you kind of what I did. Under here you can see the current uh, brake setup with the toe pedals. And what people are doing or having uh, saying they can fix this uh, uh, lack of braking. Uh, force is to move the geometry a little bit of this master cylinder. They say you can uh, take this off of here and put it in a little bit closer here. And I know some people have actually put a, a bolted another higher up uh, tube coming off here to get better leverage. If you do move this in a little closer, you really need to move this bracket uh, down here. You got to move this bracket forwards quite a bit or your pedals won't have it won't reach. Uh, you won't have enough uh, rudder authority at that point. So, hi, Future Mike here. I forgot to mention on the master cylinders, Matco does sell a uh, something called an intensifier, which helps build pressure up into the master cylinders for those that don't have the correct geometry. So, I do have the intensifiers installed. Before I installed the master cylinders on the airplane, I had sent them off to Matco ahead of time, knowing that the brakes could potentially be a little bit subpar. So anyway, just want to let you know that uh, intensifiers, that, that's an option that you can have installed in the master cylinders, and it may or may not help you. Your mileage may vary. See ya. This is quarter inch line back in here. Uh, some people say use uh, you can stick an eighth inch line in there, and that will help as well. Or, or just use still braided uh, lines. So all those are ideas you can do to, to kind of help improve the brakes, I guess. But I didn't want to go that route. I went a different route. And what I did is I went with a handbrake. But uh, this is the handbrake from uh, uh, Matco. Just a single port here. I used eighth inch line throughout. Uh, I got rid of the quarter inch line. I don't know if you can really see that that well, but there's eighth inch line coming in through here. All my connections are eighth inch as well. So how I have this routed is I have it going down the stick and then it tees from the left to right brakes. You probably won't be able to see that little brass T fitting in there way back in there. Um, again, you might not be able to see that, but anyway, there's a T fitting in there. So that's coming in from the left and from the right. And I left everything else the same, but like I said, I did go ahead and leave part of my quarter inch um, tubing right here as more of a protection. And then you can see that we end up going with the eighth inch line with eighth inch connections onto the actual brakes uh, calipers themselves. So anyway, we're going to test that out. Break. So and right. it's nice in the fact that the Parking brake now is just a piece of Velcro. <laughs> it makes it pretty simple, lightweight, very, very uh, simple design here. So uh, we're gonna try that out for several months. Right now it's working incredible. I'll flip my camera around. Right now that's working incredible, and uh, I'm actually holding in the neighborhood of 36, 3700 plus uh, RPM now instead of the 3050 I was holding before with just the toe brakes. So the handbrakes are definitely an improvement. Even when I stop, I notice uh, a physical movement inside the cockpit that, okay, I am actually stopping here, you know? So that's that part's really nice. I know these planes, uh, they land pretty slow anyway, so a lot of times I don't hit the brakes, just maybe enough to get off on a taxiway if I landed maybe a little long or something. But anyway, that's it for now. I, uh, I love the parking brake. I've flown with it now for a little while. And, uh, Again, your mileage may vary. Maybe the tow brakes are working great for you or you come up with a system that works well. But anyway, I love it so far. Uh, we'll talk to you next time.